folks, welcome to another episode of Adventures in Dog Training with American Standard Dog Training and American Overwatch Canine Services. So this is Gabby, about a five month old Rottweiler puppy. And we're just gonna show you what the first week of training would look like. We're nearing probably day five or six with training and we're working on everything. Sits, downs, heels, focus, on and off the place board. Um, you name it, you'll see it. So let's just give you a little quick glimpse as to what you could expect with a beautiful dog such as this and some good training. We are using a clicker, which is for marker training. We don't always do that, but we're just gonna, every time I click, I'm just marking a behavior that I really like. Right now, it's just engagement. Teaching competition style downs. Why not, right? Show you what that looks like. She's got a dirty sit, but we're gonna make it a pretty sit. Not the prettiest. Show you heel position. Heel position with a sit coming up. Wait for it. A little distraction. I got my little helper over there bringing a, uh, our place board <laughs> right on time. Thank you, helper. Let's see if I can work through the distraction of the little one here. And before any of you ask, this is the number one question we get. We're gonna clean up her sit, it's not the prettiest. But um, here's the question. What are you feeding her? What magical treats are you feeding her? Get ready for it, folks. You ready? How do you get this type of engagement? Hold on, we're filming something, sweetie. Just wait one second. What are the magical treats? Kibble. Kibble, baby. Kibble for the win. No, go put it back, please. Work some place board, place. Now, not to brag, but some of you might say, oh, you've been training this dog for months. No, literally five days, give or take. Two lessons a day, still some stuff to work on, like her sits are funky, down was good. We'll take that down. Let's clean, let's clean up some of these uh, positions. Trying to get a stand, then we'll get the down. Another stand. Paying for approximation now. I need to clean up her sit because it's a dirty sit. Watch the front paws. I need her to the front paws to stay right there. Now will she sit without the front paws going back? It's not what we want, so we're gonna use a little leash pressure. See if we can't clean that up. But she was taught the wrong way, so now we have to clean it up. No drop free food on the ground. And that's why, that's why I don't drop free food. Okay, good girl. That's the pretty one, big payment for that. Let's get a couple more of those. Using my foot just to help out with the stand a little. Yeah, baby, you like it. Yeah. And then here comes a pretty down. Goes into a stand, straight into a down because I want the paws to stay on the same plane, right there. Girl. Not perfect yet. Beautiful. And then into a down. Beautiful. Free. Place. You notice I'm not naming a lot of stuff. Don't name it till you love it. The sits and downs aren't pretty enough to name. Free. I can name that because it's pretty simple. Place. I can name that because I like it. And that's about it. We got, we're got. we going to keep working it for another 10 or 15 minutes, but we wanted to leave this video short, sweet, and to the point. This is a rock star of a dog with a rock star of a trainer, if you don't mind me saying so. Her name is Gabby. 
follow along, make sure to like, share, subscribe. This is a client's dog, and we're going to take her to the next level because this is a next level type dog. Not only is she a beautiful Rottweiler, come on over here and get a shot of this beautiful young lady. Not only is she beautiful, but she's just got the genetics. I would tell you how much the owner paid for this, but then you might choke on your food. Uh, but they're getting their money's worth, I will tell you that. And let's not, let's not hide it from the folks. This is a $10,000 dog. Not counting the training that she's going to get. Come over my shoulder and watch the focus. Watch. Here we go. Here comes the focus again. Now, the last little trick. The food's going to go off to the right-hand side. She's going to watch it, but we're going to wait her out. You got to look at me for the good stuff. One more time. Watch. Good job. All right, that's it. We can go on and on and on, but killer dog. Not so bad trainer. And we got a four plus weeks left with her. You can only imagine if this is how sweet she is five days in, imagine five weeks in. She's gonna be a rock star, all right? She's gonna be better trained than most police dogs. We're not doing bite work with her, uh, but I think she has the genetics to do it. But right now we're just gonna focus on some really clean obedience. Uh, in the next clip, we're actually gonna show you what a free shaping lesson would look like. Because this is a certain uh, style of training, clicker training, food luring, uh, marker training, if you want to call it, engagement work. Uh, but we're going to switch to something completely different, which is going to be free shaping, which is pretty good at. So, again, thank you all for watching. Like, share, subscribe. We'll see you on the next video. Good girl, baby.